Today, I'm excited to share my Notion wishlist tracker with you. First, let's quickly go over the layout of this page. The top of this page is made up of three parts. On the right is the filter section, where I can filter my wishlist by different categories. Just like shopping online, I can click clear filter to reset everything. In the left section, I can organize my wishlist based on my preferences, like sorting by price or priority. I can even filter by price range right here. To add a new wishlist, click the new wishlist button under quick add chunk and enter the price, link, category, and priority. And if I want to compare these items later, I can add their pros and cons. Next, if you want to add a category, click the new tag button under quick add chunk. In the middle section, I can see all my wish lists and those I've purchased and archived. I can also check the compare box to compare them. On the comparison page, I can see the prices, pros and cons of the products I want to compare. If using Finance OS, I can also click on I want this button to add this wish list to the purchase list and create a saving fund for it. I can transfer money from other financial accounts into this fund. When the savings reach the target amount, a message pops up indicating that you can now purchase the item. Finally, on the left side of the compare section, you can see the wish list that I added to high priority. I hope you find this video helpful, and you can now better manage and track your wish lists using Notion. You can also download the Notion template below to get started right away. Thank you, and stay organized.